The gentleman at my side is about to have an experience that no other actor ever had before. He's going to have a chance to see himself perform on the Broadway stage. Richard Burton, we know that movies are something you see on the screen and plays are something you see live on the stage. What is theatro film with electronavision? Well, I don't know exactly what the process is. I'm no scientist. I can't describe exactly what happens. But I have seen tests of uh, various shots of, in this new process, electronavision. And I can only tell you that to a layman like myself, it seems to be like a very well-produced film, as one normally sees it in the theater, except in, in the cinema, except that this, of course, is shot in the Lundfontein Theater with an actual live audience and with the actors performing and either being uh, adept or inadequate or good or fluffing or being articulate just as they would if you went to see a production tonight at the Lundfontein Theater. It is peculiarly unique, I think, because one does, none of the actors make any concession to this new process. In other words, we don't tone it down in order to seem like film actors or play it up because the cameras are perhaps a little further away than they would be in a movie studio or in a television studio. It's played exactly as is, and uh, the result, I think, will probably be uh, certainly unique, possibly extraordinary, and perhaps epoch-making. Ma epoch that is uh, something for the audience to decide. Will he get the immediacy of the live Broadway production of Hamlet when this is translated onto theatro film with electronavision? I think he will. I think he will because the nervousness of the actors, uh, knowing that they ca can't go back on it, that this is it for all time, uh, unlike, shall we say, in films where you can, if you make a mistake, go back and do it again. Uh, I think the particular tensity and nerves of this is, is probably uh, the same kind of thing that excites uh, a real live audience in a real live theater. Now, w what is the flight plan of this, and you've used a very good phrase, when Hamlet bursts upon the 20th century now with electronavision, Hamlet can burst in over a thousand places at once. Are you going to synchronize it so that in every town in America, people go in the same day, buy their ticket, report to the theater, and <clears throat> enjoy the play live, but not quite live? I understand that uh, it will be shown on the 23rd and 24th of September in something like a thousand theaters simultaneously for two performances on those two dates and uh, will never uh, possibly be shown again. Um, it will be exactly as they shot it in the theater. There's no cheating of any kind. I mean, it's no trick shots of... Uh, you know, on the top of somebody's head or anything like that. It's actually what you do see in the theater. Do you have any idea what impact it'll have on entertainment around the world if theatro film with electronavision connects? <clears throat> I think it could be fantastic. Uh, of course, this is very much experimental, this one, and uh, we don't quite know how well it will succeed or whether people will be interested in seeing it. We think they will because the demand already has become quite considerable, I understand. Um, whether it will become a, a major thing in the theater, I don't know. I suspect with my producer, Alexander Cohen, that it will only be for special events. Richard Burton, the actor at Ground Zero when Hamlet exploded into the 20th century.